Hi, welcome to Cat Dad Gaming. Today we'll be playing Scanner Sombra. It's the second game recommended to me in the comment section by the DJ Demon. So thank you very much. Much obliged. If you've got any games you'd like to recommend, drop them below and I'll hopefully get around to playing them. I'll leave a link in the description so you can find the game for yourself and play it. And if you like the video, consider liking, subscribing or leaving a comment because it definitely helps your channel grow. And if you can subscribe, it'll be really nice because I'm inching ever so closer to that next goal of 250 subs. So yeah. <laughs> anyway, with that, let's just get on with the game. That's <laughs> so much better. Okay, okay. So this is the second attempt now because uh, I just plugged, I just started the game and I had an Xbox controller plugged in and it was literally making the game bug out. So I was basically just spinning uh, really fast, really disorientating. Um, all right, so. What is this? I'm in the dark. Oh, very creepy. Okay, it's a VR headset. So I actually don't know much about this game. I just, uh, it was recommended to me and I went to Steam and I checked it out. Oh. Oh, that's so cool. Alright. Okay. Yeah, so I don't know much about the game, but I uh, clicked on the Steam store. It had very positive reviews. And, I mean, just look at this. So, you know, I was sold instantly. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> Do you know what to say? I'm just, uh... Beautiful, really. So I think this uh, might be a horror game in the sense of its vibe as horror. Because you're in a dark cave, uh, bla basically blindly uh, playing around. Or it could have a story that implies it, I don't, I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm getting stuck. Oh, this is so weird, I don't know how to even navigate. Oh, all right, all right. this looks like a pathy looking thing. Oh, this is so... <laughs> okay, I can see why people don't like this. Wet, squelchy sounds. Uh, blind navigation. Oof. Nobody has been as deep as this for thousands of years. Um, okay. <laughs> I was utterly alone. No call for help would ever reach the surface. Hmm, don't like that. Thanks for that game. <laughs> my friends all told me I was crazy. My wife couldn't understand my obsession. So you were Spelunker or a climber or something? But I had to know if the myths were true. Okay. So not just a explorer or a fan. So I was thinking, oh, is this just like a weekend uh, getaway and you just like, like cave exploring? No, this is a, I came to the caves to understand the myths. Let's try and get back on this path. Your path? No. <laughs> oh my god, this game is so cool though. I mean, for me anyway, this is such a unique concept. Uh, I don't think I've ever played a game that had a... No, it was just like this to be honest. Yeah, I'm kind of alright with this, um, as a setup. I think a lot of people would be terrified, um, so yeah, I get it. I'm not exactly scared of the dark, and I mean, I'm not a fan of it, but I'm not, like, terrified of it. Um, not a person. What is that? Yeah, so I'm not exactly scared of the dark, um, I don't like tight spaces, but I... This isn't really tight for me. This is like, okay. Oh. What is this? Okay, bridges. <laughs> Seriously, this game's beautiful. I, I just, visually stunning. 
Are you? Prototype installed. Aperture control. Use mouse wheel or QE to change aperture. Oh. Could this place be even older than the legends suggest? What does this do? The resolution was astonishing. Never before had such powerful geological scanner been available. Jump. So good. Oh no. <laughs> okay, this is really unnerving. Uh... <laughs> like, just walking around on the floor was fine, but if I have to do puzzles like walking on bridges, that definitely knocks up the uh, fear factor a little bit for me. Interesting. Oh, that's definitely a person. <laughs> Take a screenshot of the petite pose. Ah, <laughs> uh, what are you? Why are you here? Are you a statue? Are you following me? Shit. Wait. Ah. So you're turning sideways. <laughs> oh no, I don't like this at all. What are you? Alright, that, that is a little bit unnerving. Just a little bit. Um, hmm. This is where I'm just gonna be walking around for a little bit. That's the cut all these bits out. <laughs> Game's like, eh, please don't jump inside stuff. I kind of felt like there was something up here, but then I couldn't go that way. Unless I'm just meant to jump down. Very possible. Did not like doing that in the dark, though. Okay. Oh man, I'm gonna get so lost in this game. Um, <laughs> this is gonna be a lot of uh, a lot of <laughs> wandering aimlessly. Um. Okay, I can live with that. Yeah, it's gonna kind of get a bit uh, more focused. So we'll drop down. Drop down. Not sure. Uh, really don't like doing that in the dark. The geological scanner's really cool, but I don't see what advantage it would have to uh, doing this with the lights on. Although I guess you did just wake up, so. Hmm. Did not like that. Okay. sound. Okay, so yeah, the dark isn't an issue, but I would definitely get freaked out if I was to start hearing sounds in the dark. Oh. Zoom. Oh. Okay. Interesting. 
So, I don't think I can make that jump. That looks too far. Possible. So let's use my brain. Uh, guess jump down here first. Oh, didn't like that. Okay. Let's jump this bit. Oh. <laughs> right, so I came up this bridge. Oh, this bridge is fudged. Ah. Did I done goof? So I don't think I could have... Hang on. Yeah, so it wasn't like I had to go across that main bridge and jump onto this bridge. I think this is the right way. There's probably something that takes me up another level this way. To get to our higher bridge. That's what I'm thinking anyway. Ooh, stairs. Unless that's why I came down. <laughs> okay, what's my thought? I thought that was going to take me up to a higher level to... Ah, there we go. I was going to say, I thought the scanner was going to take me up to a higher level. Well, the scanner <laughs> takes me, <laughs> me takes me to a higher level. <laughs> uh, so I came down here, went across here. I can possibly make this jump, but it looks a little too far. And then I go to that bridge, which then takes me to that bridge, maybe? So we go. Jump. Oof. Let's make you bigger again. Are you safe? Oof. Made me jump! Don't like that noise. Let's just leave you. <laughs> this game's so good. Oh yeah. Okay. I take back my uh, chill uh, opinion. <laughs> they never did iron out all the glitches. Ah. Uh, who's they? Sometimes, you'd see sensor echoes from days earlier. Calibrations turn to ghosts. Right. So is that actually a ghost? But even so, I never could explain everything I saw. I mean, even if you're just seeing the echo of the past, it's technically a ghost. Uh, even if it's not a ghost ghost, if you know what I mean. Like, a memory or something. <laughs> don't have to say when I'm playing this. I feel kind of, um... It's like that thing where in a library you don't want to talk loud. I kind of have that whilst being in this cave alone. Like, you don't want to bring something to you. <laughs> I'm sure there's a German word for specifically for that exact thing. Uh... What are you? Oh, that looks like a big chasm. Yeah. Such a nice mechanic.
Where's my jumping distance? About that. Hmm. A jump should be possible, but not here. It looks too close. Hmm. Is this a walkable path? Looks tight. Oof. Oh, I don't like this. This. Uh... <laughs> that path could be much wider, but <laughs> oh, I don't like that. What's that? Glitching again. Okay, oh. So I'm guessing somebody jumped off here, or fell off here, or was pushed off here. Either way, somebody... Somebody went down here. Ah. Uh. Ooh. Gotta jump that. Seriously, what are these ghost things? Um, that's me, okay. <laughs> like, things like the rock sounds there. I don't know if that's just ambient sound or if there's other things with me. Oh, are you walkable? the bleepy thing now. Prototype installed. Burst scan. Press B to in initiate burst scan. Oh. Oh, so cool! Going down. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> a burst scan's really handy, actually. Um, I'm probably gonna be just like spamming that now, like every thirty seconds. <laughs> That noise is very satisfying. Pew. <laughs> okay. I'm enjoying this game, actually. Beep, 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 beep. So that one. Uh, what's going on then? So static mics and static tights. I'm going with a slope into a room with more. Right, it's over this way or this way. Is it a burst scan? That's so cool. Uh, do I want to jump down? No. Did I just loop back around? It's so hard to tell in this cave. Uh, 
shit. Let's get down. I think it's very likely I could just be walking in circles right now. Jump again? Really don't this uh jumping into the unknown kind of <laughs> Okay, that's very uncomfortable. Okay. Ooh. Geronimo. Should have jumped off there. Okay. Jump down there, it looks too too chasmy for me, liking. Are you a ledge? Let's find out. Okay. Oh ho ho ho. Ah <laughs> cheeky. Cheeky cheeky. Oof. Okay, jumping like that is really, really unnerving. Oh, the sound design is so good. Those footsteps, yeah. It really does help give the feel of being in a cave. Ooh. It's also a good way to like um, hide a uh, map. Like, what would be like a really easy path of just walk here, jump across, becomes uh, much more challenging like this. I'd be quite curious to see what it looks like with um, like actual vision. It's probably like, yeah, you literally just go down one cave, walk around like four paths and done. So there clearly seems to be some sort of like civilization here or something, because there are uh, pillars, um, columns and stuff. So there's clearly some sort of architecture here. And like this looks at least man-made rather than natural. It's too, too smooth. Hmm. The temple must have been over a thousand years old. There we go. Interesting. I knew they existed. I'd searched for the cultists all my life. Ah, uh, cultists. Oh shit, now I can actually see... But to finally see it in person. To be the first. Okay, now I've gone and turned around. Let's have a look at this. Oh yeah, that wasn't just like a couple of columns of architecture, that's um, sculpture, you know, or a big ass skeleton. So that's um, very worrying. 
Am I uh, in a temple for Cthulhu or something? Or like an elder god? That wouldn't surprise me. Hmm. Alright. Oh, you've got my interest uh, hooked already, game, so... Uh... Can't say much more than that, can I? For real though, every single rock moves makes me... <laughs> uh, panic just a little bit inside. Alright. Do another burst scan. Right. That definitely feels like, uh... Like I've just gone up the outside of an Aztec um, pyramid or something. Hmm. This is where they perform the sacrifices. Don't like that. Uh, okay, so we have some religious symbols. The more I scanned around the altar... Oops. <laughs> I looked away and missed it. But I was bright saying it felt like an altar. What are these symbols? Okay. More stairs. And another yellow upgrade box, I guess. Oh. Hmm. Map for you. Oh. Oh, this is so good. Yeah, it's what I was, uh... Okay. Wait. Cultist Monastery. Prison 1. How do I know about these? <laughs> okay, okay. I always wondered how many poor bastards they threw over the edge. Oh. oh that's so cool. Chasm, 9000 BC. Shit, space is ancient. Intrusive thoughts. Uh, what happens if I jump off? Um, do I want to find out? Hmm. Kind of do. You know, what, let's 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 do it. <laughs> Save. I just die. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> well, uh, it had to be done. It had to be done. Yeah, let's uh, so up and right maybe. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, you definitely, definitely. Definitely, definitely have uh, weird elder vibes. Okay. <laughs> ah, I did not like jumping off, to be honest. Um, at least I know, one, you can die. Two, there's nothing down there but death. Um, Cultists believed the cave itself was malevolent, that the dead couldn't ever escape.
their victims were doomed to relieve their final tortured hours forever. Oh, that's horrific. No wonder people went mad, mad down here. Yeah. Although, if you ever do anything like climbing, um, which I, I used to do a lot of climbing, I don't as much anymore now, um, but uh, I'd always go like climbing inside a gym or I'd go like outside, you know, climbing with a group of friends. But then like I saw that movie like that 24 hours or whatever, 48 hours where the guy went climbing by himself and had to cut his arm out, whatever, which is just grim. But to me, like that whole situation can be avoided if you have a buddy that you tell, or maybe not avoided, but, uh, you know, have a buddy that's like, hey, if you don't hear back from me in four hours, I fucked up on my climbing trip and I need help, you know? Yeah. Doing these kind of things solo just seems crazy to me. Um, Okay. I don't know where I'm going. Well, I mean, <laughs> that's been this whole game in a nutshell already. More so I don't know where I'm going now than before. Oh, they have stools. 12,000 years old? Ah, uh, okay. I guess made of stone or something. Jump over. Ah. Oh. Zoom. Oh, the hooks. Definitely don't have hooks. Yeah, I can only imagine that people were hung from those hooks, so that's not cool. Okay, I just looped back around to here. That's cool. I think. I'm not sure, to be honest. Yeah, I have no idea what's going on in this game. This being kept in the dark, <laughs> e. Like where I started, it seems like this scanner wasn't mine. That the cultist slept and ate here. Yeah, it felt like this scanner wasn't mine. It kind of felt like we went to investigate, and then woke up and found this scanner. Like the monks who came after, they spent their time in silent prayer to an unanswering god. Hmm. I think when I was down here, there looked like there was like a half across the chasm, but then I started exploring the beds and stuff. I've kind of got turned round. <laughs> I'm getting so disorientated down here. <laughs> Get out of the bucket, you! Haha, -ha, this looks new. Where am I going? Oh, I'm so lost! Doorways are always a good sign. Right, that was Scanner Sombra, uh, well, part one, but you might be able to see New Game Plus. I just completed it, so this is future me doing an outro, you know, e editing. So, without any spoilers or anything, what a good, good game. Uh, I loved it. So, come back for part two, it's fantastic. Um, no spoilers, no nothing, just that's it. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, consider liking, subscribing, or leaving a comment because it definitely helps the channel grow. And yeah, I'll release the next part on the Monday following part one or something. So yeah, good stuff. I hope to see you again sometime soon. Take care.